uh, and obviously most of the traffic is mobile is that mobile so everybody is actually viewing most of your home pages on mobile how does that uh, uh, changes is it a different thinking that needs to be done to make those mobile pages work better i don't think so i think it's the same idea mm-hmm. and i think there's good designers and you know web developers who have figured out ways to make these things not be so um, cumbersome mm-hmm. on, on one level it really restricts the amount of information you can include because mm-hmm. including a bunch of information on a desktop looks not too bad but once you have mm-hmm. to scroll through each of those things one at a time on a mobile it becomes very clear mm-hmm. like oh shoot we really are squeezing a lot of stuff in this and this is a bad experience so mm-hmm. limiting how much information you share keeping the length of a page shorter in generally is better like my, my one of my favorite examples is uber right giant multi-billion dollar company their website is literally four scrolls it's the mm-hmm. hero is about riding with uber the next section is about driving with uber the next section is about um, Uber for business. And then the last one is about Uber Eats. And then it's done. And you're at the footer. Four scrolls. And I'm like, I'm sure this thing converts like crazy. You know what I mean? Because it's so easy. And on mobile, four scrolls is not that cumbersome versus like, oh, just this one section that has 10 different feature boxes. That's one at a time scrolling through each of these, you know? <laughs>